So, it's been a day or two since I posted a video. I apologize. Um, as you can hear, I'm barely got a voice. I've been sick the last couple of days, but <clears throat> hasn't slowed me down now. So, um, did some job hunting on Friday. Uh, did some, turned in some applications. I filed for unemployment at the unemployment office. Um, got to follow that up today. Uh, yesterday, I went to a business meeting for a flagging position that I applied for at a temp agency here in town. Starting at like 18 bucks an hour. So, um, really hoping I can land that specific job to the temp agency. However, even if I don't, uh, they're hiring me on starting tomorrow, Monday. <clears throat> um, so, I have a job. That's good news, too. Um, here in about an hour, I'm going to be heading to the Serenity House and interviewing for um, a room at Clean Over Living. <clears throat> um, God, that'd be huge. Huge. Um, it's a huge boost in my morale, man. You know, don't get me wrong. I love this van. I worked hard for the money that I used to pay for it. But uh, after living in it for four months throughout the winter, <clears throat> I'm pretty much over it. You know, I'd be super stoked to be able to stand up and put my pants on and, um, and all the perks that come with having a place to live. Um, I take for granted um, simple necessities and pleasures that we have, right? Like, being able to do laundry whenever you want, um, cook hot food, um, access to a toilet and a shower when needed. Um, you know, those are the main things that people probably would think about when they think about homeless, but there's a lot of other things that uh, I never took into consideration prior to being homeless and having to live in a van, like having my car broke into um, twice. I've had somebody try to break into my car while I was in it, um, you know, and I live in a small town, so, um, nonetheless, it still happened, and it's still very scary, um, and anyways, you know, I'm keeping my sights focused on, you know, my goals, and I'm putting in the footwork to the best of my ability each day, uh, working towards those goals, so I feel pretty good about, um, the outcome of this room tonight. Um, I've got a lot of support and I have that feeling like I put in an honest effort. So, um, I hope I get it. Um, anyways, I will touch bases again tonight and let you know the outcome of my interview. Wish me luck. Pray I get it. And I will talk to you soon. Have a good night.